Hello you, and welcome to Twycross Zoo. <laughs> Tell me something. Yeah. What is Twycross Zoo known for? The monkeys in the Tetley Tea advert. Fire, the film's rolling. Sister! Looks like Beadle needs a cup of PG tips. Yes, hello. Find you. Steaming up. You're steaming up. Yeah. <laughs> Babe. Yeah. What are they? Some kind of cockroach, I think. Find you. Left by the feeding. This one is on my butterfly stocking list. Butterfly. Yeah. So, did you know that uh, UK butterflies are in serious decline and remain one of our most threatened wildlife groups? Here's a tip for conserving butterflies. Grow native plants. These will support pollinators like butterflies and other insects that evolved with the local plants. So today's original plan was to go to the Sea Life Centre in Birmingham, but Jay thought it was such a nice day that she wanted to be outside a bit. Yeah. So we come to the zoo instead. Oh, it's a little bit cold. It's a little bit cold, <laughs> but as you can see, blue skies in November, which we're not going to get much more of. This is and true. And can I tell you? You can tell them. Bird poo is not like any other animal's poo. They poop poo and something called urate, which is their equivalent of we. The poop See, poop. if you hadn't have come to Twycross, you wouldn't have known that, would you? And did you know that snow leopards poo around the edge of their territory? Like rabbits, don't you? I really like rabbits, yeah. Hey! Did you know? Yeah. Rabbits have 18 toenails. <laughs> Does that mean they have 18 toes? <laughs> <laughs> Tired. Oh, he's getting way comfortable. <laughs> Exhausted. Look at him digging his head out of the hole. <laughs> Hello, Mr. Dragon. Hey! <laughs> <laughs> Can you see the baby one? I think it's a bit too cold for the animals today, including me. But we've seen some really cute otters. We did, the otters were loving it, weren't they? The otters were loving it. <laughs> How does it feel? Now, at any moment, one of them could come and jump on you. They literally could, couldn't they? I'm ready. You're ready? Yeah. For a big lemur hug? I reckon, yeah, I reckon the lemur might come and eat the skittles. That's what I'm worried about. <laughs> So many, 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 many years ago, I came to this zoo with my family and took a photo near the penguin enclosure. And then about 20 years later, I came back and took another photo. And now, some years later again, I'm going to try and find the penguin enclosure and take another photo. Straight over there, Jade. Close enough. Close enough. <laughs> when they run, it's kind of like slow motion. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you.
Hey Jade. Yes, babe. Aside from guinea pigs. Yeah. What's your favourite animal? Today or generally? Forever. Um I don't know. What's about yours? Quite like a penguin. Yeah, penguins are quite cool, aren't they? Do mm. Mama set straight now, mate? Come for. Oh. oh, what happened there? Okay, we found the penguins, but I think they've changed all the signage. So this might be a bit of detective work to try and figure out where I took the picture last time. Well, I think it was right opposite, wasn't it? Hey guys. Hi. It's feeding time. <laughs> What is it? It's a capybara. It looks like a giant guinea pig. Oh, but well, that'd be nice to call up to. Uh, yeah. Can we have one? No, I don't think so. <laughs> That's it. That was our short day out at the zoo. How was it? That was really fun. Yeah? I really enjoyed it. Yeah. Super cold. Yeah. Just before we go, can we look at the lemurs that look like pandas? Okay. Get it again.